On one bright and sunny morning, Johnny and Joey decide to start a business. They both had their own great ideas, so they went their own separate ways. Johnny decided to start a brick and mortar store to sell his products. He rented out a nice building at a nice location. He hired a couple of salespeople. He printed brochures and flyers and direct mail pieces. He advertised in the local newspapers. And within a few weeks, Johnny started seeing sales and a lot of local customers. Johnny was excited, but he had a very high overhead and a very low profit margin, so he decided to wait to see some growth. Joey, on the other hand, decided to start an online store to sell his products. Joey got a nice looking website with a nice little name. He hired a content writer. He invested in online marketing and got some help with SEO and email marketing. He advertised on different websites and signed up for pay-per-click advertising. And within a few weeks, Joey started seeing sales and a lot of customers from all over the country. Joey was excited since he had very low overhead and a very high profit margin, and he could not wait to see some growth. A year passes by. Johnny was still in the same building with the same salespeople and the same marketing strategy and the same local customers. His overheads were still very high and his margins were still very low, so he decides to wait another year to see some growth. Joey moved to a new office, hired more people, and kept getting a lot of new and repeat customers from all over the country. His overheads were still very low and his margins were still very high, so he decides to start another online store to sell a different line of products Another year passes by. And on one bright and sunny morning, Johnny and Joey meet again. Joey tells Johnny about his new marketing strategy. And Johnny realizes his mistakes. Traditional marketing can only get you so far. Think local, but act global. So this time, Johnny went back and fired his rusty salespeople and fired the old school ad agencies that did the brochures, flyers, and newspaper advertising for him. He hired a good web company and outsourced all his online marketing to them. And within a few weeks, Johnny was again a happy man to see increased profits and lower overheads. And needless to say, he was very thankful to Joey for pointing him in the right direction.